Hi, I'm Tracy. I'm Lou. I'm Bradley. And today we're going to share with you seven layer dip. Mm -hmm. We have been studying Mexico and because we've got the Cinco de Mayo celebration coming up. And where is Mexico located? In the lower third of North America. Lower third of North America. Yes. Okay, so we made beans yesterday and we put them in that pan and we sliced and diced everything. So you go ahead and grate up that cheese and you go ahead and squeeze that lemon in and mash up that guacamole and we'll put it all together. And I'm just gonna talk to our friends while you guys are doing the last of the prep. Um, seven layer dip can have anything in it. Ours is going to be beans, guacamole, sour cream, olives, tomato, and chilies. You can have meat, you can have anything. Um, seven layer dip is just seven layers. Okay, good job, I'll take that. Mash it on up. Okay, we've got our first layer down. Well, the cheese will be the seventh one. Isn't you okay it, there, Bradley? Isn't that supposed yeah, to be Yeah, it's there? supposed to be there. If you keep the seed in your guacamole and use quite a bit of lemon in it, or lime, then it doesn't, uh, your avocados will stay fresh and green. And we'll pull them out before we put them in the dip. And you can use any size pan too. We used a large one, but uh, we're gonna, you can use an eight by eight or a nine by nine or any size pan. Okay, you want me to mash that where you put the next layer on? What do you wanna put on next? Um, tomatoes. Tomatoes? Well, how about that? These are kinda, of, those might spread all around. Oh, and look, we got your yeah, brand new tampoo po popo order. <laughs> now we've got one for each of you. They're perfect for kid size hands. Yeah. Go in. Woo! You're getting a workout there, aren't you? <laughs> You're probably tired by now after all the prep work. I have to put pressure on this. Yeah, you have to push on it. Good. So this is his little tampoco set. Okay, we'll take your bowl and rinse your hands off. That's the answer to that. Okay, come spread it on. That's ready. Spread it all over. Now don't push on it. Just spread it nicely over the top. Okay, let's give me a little hard. No, nope, give me your hand. And you're not gonna put pressure, you're just gonna kind of pull it just gently. See that? Yeah, just gently, and you're gonna pull it and cover it. And moms at home can help with a little bit of a pressure. And once you've got the pressure down, then you're golden. You just pull it all the way down, little teeny bit. You just want a little thin layer. Some people like a lot of sour cream. Here, let's get that out of there. Here, let me go get your um, spatula. Keep going. Keep spreading it around. We're going to put dollops everywhere so we don't get thin in some spots and thick in other spots. And then when you start to spread it, you can spread it out thinner. And we sh if we would have thought about it quicker, we could have done that with the sour cream, but it worked out just perfectly, didn't it? Okay, go ahead and take yours and just spread it out. Oh, you got the cheese done, good. Cause you're up for your layers. Can you turn that, turn it around the way you need to. Good job. Good job. Yeah, don't 
be afraid to turn it more. Okay. Which layer do you want? Do you want the tomatoes or olives? Um, tomatoes. Okay. All right. This is going to be the chili peppers. And you can use mild, medium, hot. Depends on your group. Around here, we are just to the point where we're using mediums. Everybody's old enough where they like a little bit of heat. Okay. There. It doesn't have to be completely everywhere. Some bites I'll have and some bites won't. Okay. You want olives, did you say? Or you said you said tomatoes. Okay. Now, sprinkle them on. You go ahead and do yours first, Lou, and then Bradley, you follow up and put olives. Yeah, sprinkle them all around. Yep, just like that. Good job. I like doing that. Yeah. <laughs> That's our fifth layer. And we put our salsa on the side. Some people like to put that as a layer, but we like the fresh. And the um, put up salsa. So we, we use that as an extra dip on the side. Oh, look how nice that's going to be. Let me sprinkle that. Am I almost done? Mm -hmm. A little more over there. Looks good. See around the edges here and right there in the middle? Yeah, right over here. Let's try to see if you can see it. That's looking pretty nice. Right there. Sometimes it takes more than one eye, huh? Yeah. Great. Oh, last little bit. Throw them up there in the corner. Good job. Okay. Bradley, you go ahead and do the same thing. Just like our homemade pizzas. Rinse your hands. Just like our homemade pizzas. I'm going to put olives all over. Good job. Here, let's turn the bowl. Great big bowl. You can turn it so you can make it just as... It does look like a pizza. Yeah. Well, pizza. Well, we're going to have plenty of olives on that. Yeah. We all love olives. Keep going. You guys think that's good? Looks pretty good, doesn't yeah. it? Might as well throw the rest on there. You're trying to save some so you can eat them, huh? <laughs> well, this is this is lunch, so we can just have all the olives you want on your chips. Yeah. Good job. Okay. Wash your hands. Here. Rinse your hands off. Get a paper towel. Okay, there's our six layers. Beans. Okay, come on. All right, now I put this line down the middle so we don't have territorial fights. So go ahead and sprinkle on each side, cover it with cheese really nicely. And this dish is usually served cold. Um, I guess you could warm up the beans, but we're serving it cold. Looks nice. Okay, make sure you cover it really well. Get in the middle too, guys. Get it all covered. Yes, nice. Try to get all of it out of the bucket. <laughs> all right, well, let's just go like this. Oh, that's easier. <laughs> I think we got her. This is our fun reveal. This is our finished product. Okay, let's have a taster tester. Now, we're going to use a spoon. Um, just so we don't have double oh my dipping. Goodness, mm, pretty. Look at that. And go ahead and get your handful of chips. And then we'll leave a serving spoon in it so people can um, just scoop it out. Just get him a little bit of chips. Get yourself some chips. Okay, let's have a bite. Take a bite. Let's see. Let's see what you think of it. Okay. Go 
on there. I've Good. actually never made this before. Do you like That's it? That's really nice. Should we make it again? Uh-huh. Okay. Thanks for stopping by. Please like and subscribe. And please leave a comment. Happy Cinco de Mayo. Happy Cinco de Mayo.